Hi everyone, in this session I will I'll show you how to create a simple mapping in ISS DI. So for that, click on new. You can see many options like task, mapping, maplet, task flows, components. To create a mapping, click mapping. Then click the mapping here. Then click on create. Now provide a name m underscore test then click on source uh, this is for maximizing the screen click maximize provide the uh, source name src user click source click connection select flat file, flat file source connection in object click select we have already created a flat file connection so it will point to that path you can see no files available so what I will do now I will go to the source path I will create a file Close underscore user dot txt. This I will mention id name location one danger two so, Kolkata. So I created two records. I'll use this file as a source. Now click on select. You can see the source file is available. Select that file, click OK. okay. Now click on fields. You can see the fields available. It is showing the fields, uh, data type, and precision. If you want to change the precision, for example, I want to change the precision of uh, the field location. Select that. Click on option. Click edit metadata. And uh, click the precision. Instead of 255, I want to make it as 100. So this is done. Similarly for name. I want to make it as 100. Similarly for address, for ID. Make it as uh, 10. Now we have updated the metadata. Now we have to select the target. Click on target. Maximize this screen. You can see the incoming fields. Whatever fields are coming from source file. Then click on target. Select the target connection. FF target go to object so in ISA there are two ways to load a target object or target file you can see the existing if a uh, if an existing file is there you can select that it will display here otherwise during runtime we can create so I will select a create a new at runtime I will provide the path uh, I will provide the name tgt underscore user dot txt okay so during runtime this target file will be created now go to target fields as uh, it's not an existing target for source target file so the fields won't be visible similarly field mapping also won't be visible now save Now this app. Now next thing is to we have to run the mapping. Click on run. Select uh, runtime and runner already, already selected. Select the mapping. Click run. Yeah, 
the mapping has started you can see here click this my job here or go to my jobs